Indy Mogul. You know about them? They won't stop until you're dead. Go now. Ninja Assassin, how can you resist? Warner Brothers and Dark Castle Entertainment are betting you can't as they deliver this pure adrenaline rush for the holiday season. Hot cocoa and shopping for presents is fun and all, but it's also fun to see this. And how about this? Pretty darn tempting. So how did this movie come to be? Did executives just pick two slips of paper out of the cool words hat? Actually, on the set of Speed Racer, the Wachowskis were very impressed with Rain's martial arts skills, so they decided to build a movie around him. To direct, they brought on James McTeague, who they'd also used for their adaptation of V for Vendetta. Then, to do a polish on the script, they turned to eclectic writer J. Michael Straczynski, who's written everything from comic books to Murder, She Wrote to Changeling, not to mention created TV mega-hit Babylon 5. So will South Korean pop star Rain join the ranks of Jackie Chan, Jet Li, or even Jason Statham? Who knows, but I'm sure Justin Timberlake is rooting for him. So cool. It's the shadows, you know, they get they get, you know, you can hide in the shadows and then reappear out of nowhere. Because of their staunch discipline, I suppose. They know what they're doing. They don't mess around. No. Right? It's something different that people don't see every day. They're not supposed to because they're hiding, right? <laughs> yeah. Are you a fan of ninjas? No, not necessarily. I mean, I just happened to check the movie out and this is the best movie. Well, or none that I've seen in a long, long time. All fighting and all action and pure ninjas. You don't get no better than that. The audience had um, a reaction, you know, like oohs and ahs and, ah. you know. So that's unusual because nowadays most people just kind of sit there and they don't, yeah, so that was good. It makes me want to go train, you know. Oh, <laughs> it's wow. to train, yeah. I do martial arts. Oh, right? you do? Yeah, so oh. I'm just like, wow. No, because I study, like, some, some ninjutsu. So it's kind of like, oh, well, that's pretty... It was a little historically accurate, but okay. What did you think of the new guy, the, the, the lead? Oh, the, uh, the Korean guy. Yeah, Rain. He reminded me of Tony Jaa a little bit. Was he as good as like Jet Li and Jackie Chan and stuff like that? I would say so, yes. Closest thing I've seen to Bruce Lee, baby. Wow, that is very high praise. Closest thing I've seen. Rain is a Korean pop star. Hmm? Yes. <laughs> Can he pull off the ninja? Pull it off really nicely. Really? He's a Korean pop star? Yes. A Korean pop star. Yeah. What was the coolest scene in the movie? Oh, gosh. Um, I, that's a hard one because um, it was just so many. Well, this is the Wachowskis from The Matrix. Yeah. yeah. Well, he told you. Told you, son. Is told it, you is it Matrix that. level? Yes. They have a, a, a great imagination. I love their imagination. Oh. Is this the best ninja movie battles. Yes. you've ever yes. seen? I saw it on the paper. Best ninja movie ever. Ever. Agree. We're going to see this again. Sequel. Yeah. Oh. Sequel. They want some real entertainment. I mean, uh, I would definitely recommend it. What would you give the movie on a 1 to 10? i give it an 8. 10. 12. The best that I could give it would be a 10. Yeah. Well, that's what I give it. 22. Can we go to 25? Yes, Ninja Assassin is the guilty pleasure of the holiday season as audiences give it a 14.5. And don't forget that Ninja Assassin is the focus of this week's one sentence review challenge. If you've seen the movie, leave your one to 10 rating below as well as your one sentence review. Whoever writes the best one gets a free pair of AMC movie tickets. And I'll announce the winner on Sunday's episode of Movie Math. I'm Grace Randolph reporting from AMC Empire 25 and you've just gone beyond the trailer.